This last section, I'm just going to introduce you to a specific term that you'll see regularly throughout this course. Uh, the term is correlation. All it means is a relationship between two things. Take a look at this example. This is a chart that shows, that indicates a correlation between the amount of hours a student studies in a given day and that student's grades. For example, if a student studies one hour a day, he or she could expect a 50 on the next test. If this student studies two hours a day, they'll get a 60. Three, 65, four hours a day, 66, 67, five hours a day, it jumps up to 75. Six hours a day, it jumps up to 90. And seven hours a day, it's a little above 90. Is this a perfect linear equation? No, there's not a direct relationship to the number of hours studied to the exact grades that this student will get. What we see, though, is a correlation. There is a definite relationship between the number of hours studied and the grades. It may not be a perfect line, but we could draw some kind of a straight line that connects many of these points. The point here is that what we see is that there is a correlation. The more hours a student studies, the better the grades are. Would one expect there to be a correlation between brown hair and grades? No. Brown hair students do not get better grades than blonde hair students, and blonde hair students do not get better grades than red hair students. There's no correlation between the color of one's hair and the grades that they get. At least no studies have indicated that yet. But there certainly has been, and you all know it, the more you study, the better your grades will be. Therefore, there is a correlation between the two. Sometimes you might see dots that go down. If you see something that looks like a pattern, even though it's not a perfect straight line, that's a correlation. In this case, it would be called a negative correlation. But if you see a graph, whose dots are all over the place, like this, and you don't see any discernible pattern, whatever the situation is, you can conclude there is no correlation. There is no relationship between these two things. That's what correlation means.